To understand the importance of the chain of command and clear lines of authority, responsibility, and delegation, consider the Deepwater Horizon oil rig explosion. Activities were so loosely organized that no one seemed to know who was in charge or what their level of authority and responsibility was. When the explosion occurred, confusion reigned. 23-year-old Andrea Flaytas issued a mayday distress signal over the radio when she realized that no one else had done so, but she was chastised for overstep. Ping her authority. One manager said that he didn't call for help because he wasn't sure he had authorization to do so. Still another said that he tried to call to shore but was told that the order needed to come from someone else. Crew members knew that an emergency shutdown needed to be triggered, but there was confusion over who had the authority to give the okay. As fire spread, several minutes passed before people got directions to evacuate. Again, an alarmed Flatos turned on the public address system and announced that the crew was abandoning the rig. The scene was very chaotic, said worker Carlos Ramos. There was no chain of command, nobody in charge. In the aftermath of the explosion and oil spill, several federal agencies were also on the hot seat because of loose oversight and confusion over responsibility that led to delays and disagreements that prolonged the suffering of local communities.